Hello Rose Buds, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be focusing on cleaning this mess that is behind me and doing laundry so that I don't have to clean on my two days off that are coming up. Um, we'll see how it goes and we'll bring you along with me as we get through the day. All right, here we go. Alrighty, so the laundry's been put away finally, and um, I'm going to try to tackle my black wall. Okay, um, you can see it's black except for, for right behind the Christmas tree is still that weird beige color, and it needs to be covered up. So um, I'm going to fix that right now. This is not paint. This is paper I've hot glued to the wall. <laughs> I did this in our previous apartment, and if the... If the paint is like a high finish gloss, then there's no damage to the paint when you remove it. You have to be careful, but like the the hard hot glue just kind of peels right off. And um, yeah, so I need to finish doing that wall and it will just ease my mind. So I'm going to plug in the hot glue gun, let it heat up. And then I have, this was all black construction paper that I bought from the store. It was like $7 and some change for a package of it, but it didn't do the whole wall. Um, and so I got some larger poster board from Dollar Tree and that's what we're going to use to uh, tag up there to finish that section. Wish me luck. So I'm trying to figure out how to do this without moving the Christmas tree but I have my poster board. I'm going to put hot glue at the top. Do this pretty quickly because hot glue dries fast. Okay. Oh, there we go. All right. Unfortunately, there is a little bit still showing on that side. But I'm not sure what I can do about that this time. Alright, so I'm just going to glue the bottom part down. So, The blacks don't match, do they? Urgh. I'm really mad. You didn't see that, okay? You didn't see it. So, this clearly is not going to work long term because the blacks don't match. But I am going to just put it up for... The Christmas season so I don't have to see that ugly white wall behind the well beige wall behind the Christmas tree um and then after Christmas I'll buy more of that paper and I will finish it up correctly but this is what we're doing for right now Urgh. I really thought this was going to be a cheaper solution but it would have been smart to do this board across the whole thing um, but I was just impatient and didn't want to have to go to Dollar Tree. I just wanted to go to Walmart and get everything I needed. Bad decision. Oh, well. Here we go with poster board number two. I'm 
me it doesn't look terrible but it doesn't match <laughs> like yeah but at least it's not a beige wall that's all I'm at least it's not a beige wall at least it's not a beige wall say it with me at least it's not a beige wall all right hello rosebuds um I'm at work and it's it's snowing <laughs> again. Uh, I left for work a little bit early because I knew I had to drive really slow to get here and it started snowing again. So uh, your girl loves the snow, but she's not mega confident driving in it. So um, I'm gonna go in in just a minute, but I just wanna talk to you guys about my makeup I have on right now because I think it looks really good and it's only three products. So yeah. Um, of course, I have my skincare on, which your makeup is only going to look as good as your skin is. Um, but I have Zen Mascara on, some BB cream around my eyes and on my chin because of a breakout. And then my favorite superstar lipstick. Um, this is liquid lipstick. It's matte and it's my favorite. I think everybody, for every woman, there is a shade of red lipstick that will look fabulous on you. Don't be afraid of reds, especially around the holiday season. And I, I just love the way this looks. You could add a... A black liner to this you of course that you could add anything okay onto this look. this is very basic but I just really like it it's really pretty and I'm gonna go into work and work for you know six seven hours and then I'll be home so yay sorry I know this vlog has been kind of boring but not every day is that interesting <laughs> to be fair so yeah here's a reminder for you guys to Ladies, put a little bit of makeup on, make yourselves feel better, and do the laundry. <laughs> That's what this vlog has been. Alrighty, so I made it home safe. Um, the roads were not the best, but I made it, so that's the important thing. No accidents. Little sliding, so... Um, I just need to take my makeup off and get ready for bed. I'm already in my cozy room. Uh, so I'm just going to use my, what is this, Five Face Makeup Remover. Here we go. And I have these little cotton swabs that I get from Dollar Tree. Just like the flat ones. You get 80 in a package at Dollar Tree. That's where I usually get them. But, um, and then when I travel, I just put a couple of these in a Ziploc bag and then spray this on them so I don't have to take the whole bottle with me and worry about it, like, leaking or something. But, still very happy with my makeup look today, I will say. I don't know why I use this on my forehead and stuff. I only had makeup around my eyes and chin, so. <laughs> Habit, I guess. This is about to look really funny. I'm about to look like a clown here trying to get this lipstick off. Ready? <laughs> Looks so funny. Oh. This stuff is a little hard to get off. And yeah. Fun, fun, fun. You can still see I have part of it still on, so I'm going to take my lip scrub. And um, this lip scrub is just um, olive oil, brown sugar, and coffee grounds. And I have like the espresso coffee grounds, so they're really fine. But I'm just going to glue that on here. I don't use this every night or every day. Usually just when I'm wearing the the matte liquid lipsticks. Or if my lips are really, really chapped. Right now it's winter, so they're chapping a lot easier. I'm just scrubbing all the dead skin off.
My poor face is like real red. <laughs> There we go. Tea time. Um, I bought this off of Amazon um, because the Halfway Hippie told me I needed it. <laughs> um, if you don't follow her, I, I really like her stuff. But um, it's a tongue scraper. This one's metal. It comes in a two pack for like 10 bucks. So just kind of get all the bacteria out of your tongue. It's most important that you do this first thing in the morning more than evening. But um, I'm not going to brush my teeth yet because I'm not exactly real. And I don't want to brush my teeth and then the serum. I have to brush them again. Seems counterintuitive, you know what I mean? Let's go get some cereal. Alright, tell the good people what game you're playing. Godfall. Godfall, okay. And if you had to rate this game on a scale of 1 to 10, what would you rate it? 10 uh, being the best. I'm not really in that far into it, but I mean, so far I'd probably say like a solid 7 or 8. Seven or eight people, that's what I'm talking about. All right, I've got my Cheerios um, in my bowl here, and I'm gonna eat this while he finishes playing, and then we'll probably watch something. But I'm gonna sign off this kind of boring vlog today. Um, probably tomorrow will be better because I don't work tomorrow, so here's hoping. Uh, fingers crossed. <laughs> yeah, have a good night. Thank you so much for spending the holiday season with me. Go ahead and hit the like button and the subscribe button. Share it, all that jazz, and have a wonderful evening or day or whatever time it is you're watching this. It's evening for me. Good night.